It doesn't matter. Uh, is Jessica here? Yeah. Jessica. Okay. Uh, well, our first winner was the for best overall visualization, and we just found this one. So the way we did this is we had a, a team of I think five or six different people, a couple of people at CDOT, a couple of people at Divi, looked through all the entries and kind of um, looked at them to see, fit them into categories, and we had categories of best overall visual, visual visualization, most beautiful, most comprehensive, most insightful, and then most creative. And on most of the categories, except for most creative, we narrowed, up, narrowed down the choices to just one top uh, choice. And in the first category, best overall visualization, uh, Jessica won. Jessica, you want to talk us through your uh, entry? Yeah. Uh, so I tried to uh, You can go up there and point it if you want. Um. <laughs> you, should, you should come up. No? Okay. <laughs> um, I tried to create something that would make all the information that could be released accessible to someone who had never even heard about it. So looking at it straight off the bat, they would know it's Chicago, and then they would they can go and learn about what they use it was used, what type of people use it, um, and where it's used the most. Um, and then I tried to pick out some numbers or stats that I thought were either just a huge number or an interesting number, and then relate it back to Chicago in some sort of way. So there were like 15 million minutes that they rode, and you can watch Ferris Bueller's Day Off 150,000. <laughs> yeah, we, we really like this entry because uh, of things just like that in particular reference because there were lots of, um, it pulled it, it looked at the data but also kind of described it in whimsical ways and I can't read any of them from here but that's my problem. Uh, but the Ferris Bueller and lots of other things, what was the one about? The day, the day it launched was National Cucumber Day. Oh, that's right. Okay. <laughs> Uh, one the subs, is that one a sub or a hot dog? I can yeah, one Divi bike weighs about the same as 2,867 Chicago dogs. Um, <laughs> the average rider was born in like 1978. I think the same year that Saturday Night Fever came out. Yep. Um, and the price of a Divi subscription costs about the same as like a black box ticket. So. All right, cool. Thanks, Jessica. That was we really just thought. It, I think that it was things like that. Those sort of fun little facts that tied together the data, and actually analyzed the data, but also tied it together made it a lot of fun for us. So we like this one a lot.